This is Math 88 uh, midterm practice, and this is problem number 7. And I'm going to solve this for x squared. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to isolate the x squared. So I'm going to add 20 to both sides. And notice if I do that, I get x squared equals 1. And now I can square root both sides. And now when I bring that square root in, a plus or minus comes with it, because it could be positive or negative to give me 1. So that means x equals plus or minus 1. So x equals negative 1 or 1. Both those answers are the answers that you're looking for.